yo what's up guys welcome back to a brand new video so i wanted to do some sort of guide on the most amount of money possible that you could be making in reboot as a newer player so obviously the first one and probably most known way to make money in reboot is going to be from doing ursus daily three times a day so with Urs ursus it's dependent on your level on how much money that you make per run but for an example i get about 38 mil per run so if i do that three times per day i get about 114 mil daily and if i do that seven days a week i end up getting around 800 mil daily now obviously on your level it's going to differ but it could range anywhere from around 650 mil weekly to 800 mil weekly now the other way that you can make money with like a new as a new player and with no funding at all is going to be through maple tour so with maple tour there's a few different options if you don't have any maple points to spare you can do it two times a day for free without having to spend any maple points and if you were to be doing it around two times per day it'd be 24.5 mil per run and then obviously if you do that twice per day it comes out to about 49 mil daily at the end of the week it is around 343 mil weekly so now obviously if you're gonna cap seven days a week which most people won't do but just to give the numbers out if you were to cap seven times a day weekly in maple tour you would end up coming out with about 1.2 bill now most people aren't going to be doing that so i'll just put up the numbers that most people will do and that's going to be two times a day weekly and that will come out to around 343 mil per week the newer change that people know about but they might not actually be as aware of is going to be daily bosses now daily bosses just recently had a change and increase the amount of money that you get per boss crystal and they also change the amount of weekly crystals that you can cap on now the reason why this is good is because you can actually make a ton a ton of money doing this with very very low funded characters uh, in the example video that I'm showing, I'm just doing these bosses on a level 200 Kaiser with literally zero funding and no links on. So it could kind of simulate more of a newer player doing these bosses. So if you were to just do normal Zoc, Easy Pap, Easy Magnus, normal Hilla, Ramaru, normal Horn Horntail, normal Bellum, normal Queen, normal Von Bon, normal Pierre, easy Von Leon, and easy Arcarium. That would come out to around 12 bosses, and that would come out to about 50 mil per day. Now, obviously, if you do that seven times per week, that comes out to around 350 mil per character. Now, where it kind of gets a little bit more interesting is if you have no other way of making money, and you have no miso gear or drop gear, and you really don't have any efficient places to train on, on totem, or if you're just completely out of totems, you can cap boss mules doing these really easy boss mules with literally zero funding at all if you were to cap out boss crystals weekly you could end up doing 15 characters every single day and instead of making 350 mil weekly you could end up making around 5.25 bill a weekly from just capping out on characters with pretty much little to no funding so i know it's kind of a lot and it would it would definitely take a ton of time to be capping out on each character but if you don't really have any resources and you don't have any totems or you don't have any miso and drop gear and you're just starting out and trying to get to that point where you're cubing miso and drop gear doing this could definitely be like a really really good option to getting a very quick start to your progression so if we were to take up all the totals from ursus maple tour and doing daily bosses on 15 characters it would end up coming out to be around 6.4 bill per week which is actually a ton a ton of money you could probably fund an entire character with miso and drop gear just by doing that one week and then kind of set yourself up moving forward to like actually efficiently train on totems now obviously everybody is going to vary differently in terms of how often or how consistent they do this method but if i were a new player i definitely would try and cap out as many crystals as possible for starting off because i know that initial start is definitely the hardest cubing for me so in drop gear can be terrible like you're only making sometimes 100 mil an hour with no gear at all so this definitely could be a very good option just to do for your first week to get that initial amount of money to cube me so in drop gear so then moving forward you can farm efficiently and make around make upwards to like 600 
to potentially 700 mil an hour with full miso and drop gear as of right now these seem to be like the only real efficient ways of making money obviously training and farming is always going to be the number one way to make money but i know a lot of people don't like to sometimes commit for two two hours at a time so this is definitely a, a solid alternative and definitely a really really good uh, option for newer players who have pretty much zero funding at all and only have legion characters made but if there are any other types of methods that you guys know of or have used in the past uh, please leave them in the comment section below so other people can kind of bounce off of your ideas and use the strategies that you guys have used to help yourselves out but for now that is going to be it hopefully you guys enjoyed the video if you have any video ideas for me to do in the future definitely drop those in the comment section below but until next time guys i'll see you later peace